Ross, so we've got Torquay tomorrow night, obviously another challenging fixture in what has been a real tough run, but um, after after the four games in two weeks, we, we stand here with three wins from three. Did you ever think that was going to happen? I think uh, like coming in the Monday we came in, I, I was probably... I'd have been unsure uh, coming in with sort of Terry and James and having not known what the group was like or how they were going to react. But I think I've to have them coming in and work with them initially um, for that week uh, and seeing how sort of positive they were to, to what we were trying to do and the sort of um, the belief we were trying to instill in them. Um, uh, I was pretty confident that we'd do well. And, and obviously the, the three out of three is unbelievable. Um, but I've sort of had a lot of faith in sort of how they worked and how hard they've worked. So... They fully deserve it, um, and uh, yeah, I must say it's, it wasn't a massive surprise in terms of performance. But getting the free results obviously is amazing, and, and I don't think we could have wished for. A, obviously, I couldn't have got a better start, really. It's another you know long trip um, like Yeovil last week. Um, we saw the shots fans out in, in brilliant numbers, brilliant support in, in both Tuesday and Saturday. Actually, credit to them for the longer journey. So you know it'll be good to reward their effort, won't they, with a, with another away win? Yeah, definitely. And obviously, like they, they, they've had a tough, I guess, a tough couple of seasons with us where we've been. And, and, and I'm not saying like it's three games, isn't it? It's only three games and. I'm not saying this is going to be like this all of the time, but it's a positive start and the support sort of Saturday was unbelievable. So like them jumping on it and, and, and sort of enjoying the way we're trying to play is, is, is really pleasing. And obviously the more that can come to Torquay to support us is, is amazing. Uh, we'll always try and give, do our best and we'll always try and follow the plan and how we want to be as much as we can. So yeah, the support's outrageous. I think it's always been outrageous. And like in terms of where we've been the last few seasons hasn't quite been where we would expect to be or, or maybe um, as a club where we'd want to be. Um, but obviously the three games has given us a little bit of a little bit of momentum. It's tough having three game, four games in 10 days, um, but hopefully that momentum will help us bounce into tomorrow and you sort of get through it on adrenaline and you get through it far by by having done the last match so quickly, so little time to prepare. Um, so yeah, hopefully it's a positive or positive tomorrow. Sometimes you stand here and you you know pick out key players and how they've done in the last four games, but it's it's quite difficult to do that, isn't it? It's been an absolutely incredible run for for, for all the players, really. And they're a good group. They're like like there's lots of like um, uh, a lot of people can say it's it's me, James, and Terry, and a lot of people can say it's the staff, and uh, they're a good group. Like they they're the ones who step on the pitch, and they're the ones who need to do what they need to do. And I think with with how we've instructed them and, and the, maybe the belief and confidence we've tried to give them. Um, they've done really well. Like I think parts coming back. Like I have probably I was thinking the day I haven't mentioned him in, in much of my interviews, but like him coming back and um, probably not even like me putting the pressure on him. But he's such a an important player in that group, and not just in terms of ability wise. Like he's a leader, and he, he's he's someone who carries out the instructions that we need and that we give the team, so and, and carries them out on the pitch. So he's sort of like our a manager on the pitch in itself, really. So. Uh, he's been invaluable. Um, it's difficult to pick out players because I think the whole group's been excellent and they have this new confidence and belief. And it, like I said to you at the beginning, it's not going to last forever. Um, there is going to be bumps and there is going to be sort of like uh, um, things that little little blocks in the way. But I'm sure I'm pretty confident in terms of how we work with them that they'll be fine and we'll bounce straight back. And we're beginning to see what McNeely ball means, aren't we? And we saw it in all of its brilliance on Saturday, didn't we? In terms of like high pressing and high pressing, yeah, we want to press high. We want to be, we want to be in the team's half of the pitch, and and I don't think it's it's not anything new. And like there's a lot of teams um, in our league do it. Like obviously county county keep really good possession and, and and press well. And there's teams obviously in higher leagues who do it. So it's not new. And and just to try and bring bring, some, bring something that we believe in, uh, me James and in, uh, in particular. Um, to to the first team and to the boys and they bought into it and like, that's a key thing right like if they don't buy into it it makes everything so much more difficult but they bought into the high press and I, I said to you I said to you on Saturday I think we can keep the ball better um, we we, we want to do more work on that um, otherwise we just find ourselves pressing all of the time um, and that's hard to do so we certainly need to be better in those transition transitional moments our shape and space needs to be better when we've got the ball. Um, like we've done a lot of work on on them being closer to players and on the formations and how that might look. Um, but they need to also we need to work on 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 being further away from players when we get the ball and or finding those spaces when we get the ball. Um, it'll help us a lot in keeping possession. Keeping possession is is a key part of where we want to be as well.
Click here for the latest match highlights and click here to subscribe. Are you in with a shot? Look below for more information.